everyone. Thanks for visiting my channel. If you are new, thanks for stopping by. I'm so glad to have you here. So today we are gonna be doing something really yummy. We are going to make sourdough biscuits and they are wonderful because they are made with the discard from your sourdough starter. Now, just as an FYI, I am currently working on a video for you guys on making your own sourdough starter if you don't already have one. But discard seems to be um, an issue for people and it is because it feels wasteful when you go to feed your starter that you either have to use your discard or throw it away. So I'm on a mission to come up with a lot of recipes for you guys to use your discard so we don't feel like we're being wasteful. And today, sourdough biscuits are fantastic for this. This recipe is from King Arthur Baking. You guys, if you've hung around my channel very much, you know that I love them. They have a million, almost a million uh, recipes on their website and lots of great advice and how to's. So anyway, and I love their products as well, but this recipe is from their website. It's super simple. All you need is one cup of sourdough starter, one cup of all purpose flour, a teaspoon of salt and two teaspoons of baking powder and eight tablespoons of butter. That is it, really basic and really yummy. The biscuits themselves have a little bit of a crispy crust on the outside. They're light and fluffy on the inside and really easy to make. So let's get started. Okay guys, here we go. We're going to need one cup of flour and I fluff and then scoop. Fluff, measure and scoop and then level it off. Then we need two teaspoons of baking powder. We need one teaspoon of salt. And then we're just gonna whisk that together. And then we're going to take a half a cup, eight tablespoons of cold butter, and I've cubed it just to make it easier to work with. And we're going to incorporate that into our flour mixture. Now, I like to use my hands and break it up. You want it to just look like, you want coarse crumbs when it's ready. Um, you can also use a pastry blender here. Some people like to use their food processor. It's up to you. We just want even coarse, coarse looking crumbs. Okay, once you get your butter incorporated into nice coarse crumbs, then we are going to add one cup of unfed sourdough starter or your discard. And we're gonna stir that in. Now, if it seems too dry, you can add a tablespoon at a time of milk to your mixture to get it wetter. We just wanna incorporate that together gently. We don't wanna to do too much mixing because then they can become tough. So just gently mix them together. Okay, once it comes together in a ball, it's ready to, we're ready to pat it out. So we're just gonna sprinkle a little bit of flour on our surface and then take our ball and we're gonna pat it down to about one inch thick. And you wanna do this gently, we don't want tough biscuits. And I do kind of like a rectangle we're gonna to try to get four biscuits out of this. And when you cut your biscuits, you wanna just push straight down. You don't wanna turn your cutter. Um, crimped edges don't rise as high as uh, edges that are straight. And then you're just gonna put it on a baking sheet lined with parchment paper. So 
you should get about four biscuits out of your first go round. And then we're going to gently put these back together and get two more. So take your scraps, pat them back together. We'll see if we can get two more. So I got one more nice one. And then I'm just gonna take the scraps that are left and I'm just going to shape him into a round. And it, they don't have to look perfect. They're gonna taste amazing. Okay, so we're going to pop those into a preheated 425 degree oven for about 20 minutes till they're nice and golden brown on top. Okay guys, how easy was that in a beautiful, delicious way to use your sourdough discard? Look at those beauties back there. So let me give you a close up. Nice golden brown, light and fluffy on the inside. So yummy together. So let's give it a taste and see how we did the outside has a nice um, almost crust like to it so it's kind of crunchy on the outside but light and fluffy and so tasty on the inside mm. oh my goodness you guys you'll never want to make biscuits any other way again they have so much flavor and just this beautiful texture to them they are fantastic and super easy to throw together so I hope you enjoyed coming along with me today. I hope you enjoyed uh, this recipe. Leave me comments, questions, all that down below. This is a great way to make biscuits and a wonderful way to use your discard. So I hope you will give them a try. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share, and I will see you next time. Have a great day.